This presentation illustrates using CodeLink to reset the steering angle sensor on a 2011 Toyota Camry. Although other Toyota vehicles may be reset in a similar manner, always follow the prompting instructions provided for the selected vehicle. If the selected vehicle is equipped with electronic stability control requiring reset, or even if it's optional, you will see the code link icon placed in the procedure bar. After completing the wheel alignment, begin the reset procedure by selecting Reset Onboard Systems or the code link icon here at the procedure bar. Once selected, the display will change stating electronic stability control may be optional. Using the table provided, determine if the vehicle is equipped or simply select Yes, because CodeLink will confirm this once connected. This vehicle is equipped with VSC, so we'll select Yes. To begin the procedure, remove the brake pedal depressor, place the transmission in park, and be certain the parking brake is not set. If the vehicle is equipped with a manual transmission, Place it in neutral and set the parking brake. Turn the ignition to the on position and then connect the code link tool to the diagnostic connector below the steering column. Once this is done, select K4 at the code link tool, which is the same as selecting continue at the aligner. CodeLink will now check related onboard systems for fault codes. This can take a minute to complete. Next, while observing the steer ahead bar graph, steer the front wheels straight ahead. Remember, even though the alignment procedure is finished, the aligner is still measuring the position of the wheels. The numeric display here at the right is the output of the steering angle sensor. CodeLink is measuring this. Disconnect the CodeLink tool and turn the ignition off. Now, disconnect the cable from the negative terminal of the battery. Leave it disconnected for 5 to 10 seconds. And, as instructed, do not use a memory saver device to power the vehicle. For confirmation of this power down sequence, refer to Toyota's service bulletins listed here in the instructions. Next, reconnect the battery cable. Turn the ignition on and reconnect the code link tool. Now, select K4 at the code link tool to continue. Calibration of a steering angle sensor and other OE-specified sensors will now be initiated. While this occurs, do not disturb the car. Next, verify the ABS and VSC lights on the dash are blinking rapidly and at the same rate. Now, select K4 at the code link tool and calibration will be completed. When finished, the display will confirm the calibration was successful. To verify, re-steer the wheels to straight ahead and check the output of the steering angle sensor. It should be zero. On some vehicles, the steering angle sensor is not live at this point. For those, Simply verify a zero output display. Now, select K4 at the CodeLink tool to continue. CodeLink will now recheck related systems for faults. When this is done, turn the ignition completely off and disconnect the CodeLink tool. The reset procedure is now finished. When the code leak procedure is successful, confirmation is included at the bottom of the summary printout. You can also select a separate code link printout from the list at the left.
Scroll. Highlight. And print. If the reset procedure was unsuccessful, that result will be indicated here.